Hi, welcome to the Wellbeing Farm Tour. So I'm Celia Gaze, uh, Managing Director, and I'm going to walk you around today. So we're standing at the entrance of the barn um, outside our eucalyptus um, arch, and we're going to have a bit of a walk in. The idea is I'm going to walk you through how you would um, go through the day of your reception or wedding, and um, we'll i'll talk you through all the different elements and all the things that are included in the venue hire we're an exclusive venue so everything you see is included in the venue hire today we're going to go and do the wedding barn then we're going to go outside we're going to do all the other buildings we're going to have a look at the farmhouse we're going to have a look at all the areas so this tour is about 20 minutes in length okay so off we go in we walk into the barn and obviously in the summer this is like a cottage garden it's all beautiful it's all overgrown you know it looks overgrown but it's intended to be that way because i wanted that sort of cottage garden look so you enter the doors of the barn and if you think if you're a guest and you think what on earth am i going into and you enter this space with four thousand fairy lights this is the actual wedding bar where we're in so features is we have a lovely bar here bar area bar stools are there uh very well equipped with a good range of uh gins and whiskies and everything else good range of different beers we've tried to get some of the beers which are not as usual there we are and uh, it's open till one o'clock in the morning for booze drinking dancing to have a really good fun wedding some of the other features here is our brew station. So at any point throughout the whole of the day, evening, any of your guests can just help themselves to a cup of coffee or tea. Uh, we've got, this is our naughty corner. So your guests can catch up those relatives and you can see all the different, uh, you know, the whole site. It's quite a big area. As you can see, I'll just show you the ceilings and all the fairy lights that they have. These are original military uh, parachutes that would have been used for tanks uh, on jeeps to lower tanks and jeeps in, um, in originally. If you have got disabled gas coming, we are fully equipped. That's a platform lift up to the stairs. And then this is the actual barn, a wedding barn. As you can see, it's pretty big, holds 300 standing, 180 seated. And everything included in here is included in the higher price. But there are some extras on display, which are, are, are obviously extra. So some of the features we've got today are, this is the, the actual main barn, beautiful wooden floor. We provide all the tables, chairs, all the equipment, all the decor. You can see we've got the lights up. We even provide the bunting to decorate it uh, on here. And we've, there we are. Um, the, those trees we haven't provided, they're not ours, they're Let Love Blossom, Let Love Blossom, who have provided those. But we do provide these beautiful tables. It's not really a venue for tablecloths. We provide these really lovely quality wooden tables and we provide the chairs, which are original vintage chairs. We have cushions for them and you can decorate them with these various ties. Some of the things that you can have to make your wedding really fun, you've got a load of um, indoor games which you can use. You have um, a sweet cart for your guests to enjoy. We've got the strongman game. And then walking around here, lots of sort of different signs, different things which you can all adapt to suit your wedding. Let Love Blossom again have provided this lovely arch. The ceremony today is done in a circus style, which is quite on trend, but obviously you can have any style you want for your actual ceremony. Uh, we set it up, we help you. Sometimes if the, if the room is available, you can come in the day before. Otherwise, we will help set it all up according to your specifications. We've got um, over here, we have the love letters, which are all included. We have bride and groom thrones. We have a lovely arch that you could use if you wanted. Um, this is our DJ booth in the corner. Then if down here at night, this area turns into the dance floor. So you don't know, need one of those sort of white dance floors because... Um, we've got a beautiful wooden dance floor. And, and to be honest, everybody just dances anywhere they like. <laughs> so it's that kind of venue. We're very relaxed. So as you can see, it's, it's very hard to see the size of it. I really, really, really would encourage you to come and visit when we can, when you can, to see the venue open. 
we've tried to go with a very colourful look today to showcase, you know, get a bit of fun and a bit of colour into our lives in this third lockdown. So, yeah, got some straw bales. If you wanted, you can have your ceremony on straw bales. It's entirely up to you. And then walking back down some of the other features which you can have or use. Um, this is a Prosecco or gin bar or cocktail bar, whatever you'd like to use. We have the top table, but obviously the top tables can be joined together. So to have that sort of medieval banquet style, if you wanted for your wedding. We have over here, um, spot the rat game. <laughs> there we go, little rat rat there. Um, we have a cake cart, so you can put your cake on that beautiful Victorian original cart there. We also have a gin bar, which I'll show you in a second. Donut bar, or a little bit of a donut wall. We have popcorn machines, candy floss machines. We have even have a pepper pig for the kids. Um, so that's your cart. This is a gin bar, which you can have for your wedding. Uh, great, so you, you, your guests just pull a glass off and then grab the gin and whatever tonic they want to go with that. And there's some sort of uh, garnishes and flavors in the tubs. This is a cart which you have, you can have it as an option for dessert, you can have a cake cart with all different cakes on there. That's where you have your sort of entrance to go into the, uh, you know, gift table, I mean. This is lovely because you can have extra photographs under this little tunnel, which is really pretty. And then the toilets, we have well-equipped toilets in, on this site. Um, beautiful, quite unique signage. There we are. And then in here, I've got to show you this, I've got to go in the men's toilets. Not often in a tour that you get a whole look at all the men's toilets and things, but these are very, very unique. Um, as you can see, they are buckets. Original buckets used actually in the building of this barn. So you've got lots of unique features. All our toilets are twinned because we're a very, very sustainable venue. And in, also there is a disabled toilet in there as well. So we're gonna go back through, back through the barn. We'll say goodbye to our lovely barn, back down the stairs. Uh, got a piano, if anyone's good on the piano, they can play that, that's tuned in. So you've got your bar here. Uh, Bruce Station will go back out to our next area. So back out. Over there we have um, a well-equipped pizza oven, wood-burning pizza stove and barbecue. And we also have a hog roast machine. Going back out, we're going to almost go a little bit backwards now. <laughs> we have stocks and things to make your wedding fun. We've got a photo wall here where you can have one of those flower walls. We've even got a dog kennel if you bring your dog and pets are allowed. In here is our prop shed. This is all included. You literally just come in here six months before your wedding, have a good look in. We've got loads of baskets, signage, blankets for the fire pit, balls in the ceiling, loads of different chair ties all sorts of signings, flowers, vessels, table number holders, log slices, jars, various ways to put your flowers on the table, lamps, all sorts of things. So you just come in and literally just choose. And there's two more sheds of things like that. These are the stars of our show, the llamas and donkeys. Uh, they literally will interact with you as part of your wedding. So we have two donkeys, uh, an alpaca and four llamas and the donkeys wear flat caps and the llamas will all wear bow ties. I'm sure you've all seen lots and lots of pictures of them on your wedding. Pete there will be there as part of your wedding with the animals. He's the person who looks after the maintenance of the farm plus all the animals and he will be with the animals on your wedding day. So don't worry if, the, you know, but, the, but what is for sure is the llamas are not in a pen. They're literally mingling with your guests. So while how Pete is stood with it very close to a llama, that is what your guests would be doing with a llama. <laughs> llamas are very well trained not to spit. Uh, they're trained in, to deal with people. So it just provides a very, very unique completely unique wedding experience for yeah. you. And it just gives you something that your guests will just remember forever. So... So there you go. Um, moving on. Uh, I'm not sure if you can see it in the distance, actually, but we are powered by a wind turbine. No. Oh, yeah. 
Not going round today. No wind. No wind. I'm not going round what all week? All day. Oh. No wind. No wind whatsoever. Anyway, there you go, moving on. Um, here's, uh, we have photo walls quite a lot because photos and weddings are incredibly important, let's face it. So, loads of opportunities. You could be a butterfly. You could be an angel. Just, you know, imagine all your guests out here having a really good fun time, you know. This is what we're all after. In here we have a llama boudoir, which is like a selfie um, station. And in there, loads of llama themed props in that basket in the corner. But really lovely little cute idea. This is all included in the hire. This is a smoking shelter. We've got a Connect Four game going on in there, all heated. This is where your guests go to have a quick, quick cigarette if they want, quick smoke. Um, you've got a cocktail bar opening more in the summer, I'll be honest. Cocktail or bar, uh, bottle beers or gin. So that's a gin bar. It's called Baro Llama. In here, these are where we sometimes serve the welcome drinks. All the tables are on here with all your guests at night. It's a nice summery evening. <laughs> here we are in snow. Um, but you know, we've got a fire pit going on. You've got your toasting the marshmallows. We've got the s'mores going. It's like you can do a little bit of a, you know, sparkler thing going on. You know, really lovely sort of uh, look there. This field is our games field and we have so many different games that you can do. We have go-karts for the kids, croquet round, rounders, sack races, crazy golf, connect four, tug of war, space hoppers, giant Jenga, toss a bean bag. We have quoits, we have all these things. We have one of these bride and groom, we have to kind of throw them in there. Cra even have a crazy golf course. The pavilion over there, which we'll probably go around afterwards, is... Um, it's licensed for outdoor weddings so you can have those american style weddings where you all sit on benches and again a nice kind of atmosphere for you coming on we're going to walk around here we oh by the way we have two car parks one over there just at the back so it's right very close to the barn and one by the entrance of the farm so the one at the entrance of the farm where you can see that big block of snow is um an overflow car park we also have electric gates so we're very very secure so if you wanted those gates closed when all your guests arrive that's absolutely fine license pavilion there set up to have the backdrop so i'm sorry about the views <laughs> but normally if you were standing you can see right over to north wales we are located 700 feet above sea level and we do have incredible views except today <laughs> when i'm doing the virtual tour which is just typical never mind it's not raining so that's the main thing a little bit of a dove coat we are actually getting doves for the dove coat so that's something else um over there we have our big love sign uh this is set up and positioned here because this has the best views at the background and this is you could have your bridal party all located and having and standing there as a backdrop so again that that is all included we also have our hollywood style cinematic board which can be personalized as a very large welcome board for your guests so that could be personalized with your name uh what else this bit this blank space here normally has a blue vintage tractor and the llamas come with you you sit on the tractor and the llamas are the either side and you get to enjoy them and over there at the back we have you can just about see it over there we have um polytunnel where we grow all our edible flowers and we also have another um like a, call it our love shack this is another building all of this this other building is including your hire so you not only get the wedding barn but you actually get all these buildings too so i'm now going to show you all these this is where the groom or whoever couple the other half arrives before your wedding with your best men or bridesmaids or whatever you're wanting to do and you would come into this barn there this is our wheat sheaf bar and so basically you would come in here and be having and enjoying a drink in so this is fully licensed as well so we actually have three bars on site got the wheat sheaf bar that's our awards wall. We are a multi-award winning business. So we even won the 
national um, events, wedding events team of the year last year. So very, very proud of that. In here, again, lots of photo opportunity areas. Got one of those sort of 70s style <laughs> swinging chairs. This is supposed to be sort of tropical style, but again, you've got your bar through here, plenty of space if it's wet weather or it's raining or whatever, you've got a good opportunity. This is our tree of love. So all previous couples at some point will end up on our tree of love. So you've got your little, little quirky little features. Got a pelican alarm on that each other. <laughs> and you can see we've got Mrs. and Mrs. Mr. and Mr. Mr. and Mr. Mrs. And Mr. And Mr. And Mr. We cater for a very all types of weddings, that's what I'm trying to say. And again, through here, you get all of this. This is an extra room. Sometimes we do meetings in here, hence the tablecloths and things like that. But, but normally it's an extra big space for your guests to mingle. It's got lovely cartwheel light, lights, um, got nice beam ceiling. And you can see how kind of this is, this, you know, lots of space. So you've got all of this as well. And then go back down. In this building, you've got toilets as well, all twinned. You don't know the, twi the twin with a toilet and a uh, poor part of the world. So for example, that toilet is twinned in uh, with, um, that, this toilet here is twinned with um, oh, Cambodia or something like that. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, there, that's the farm. You can originally see that the farm, you know, originally was, you know, looked like this. So various around the buildings are how the farm was built because it was a transformation of love. Up the stairs, uh, you, this is something that you can hire out as extra. That if you wanted an area for, usually the grooms go in here and the bride in a farmhouse sometimes, or it can be the other way. And that is the the uh, this is called our snug snug area, and it's an extra hire feature where you can get ready. It's got an espresso coffee machine, it's got fridges, and all sorts. We have a prosecco. It's got a bathroom. There we are. So we'll go back down. This also doubles up as a staff area, hence it's a bit crazy. <laughs> there we go. Uh, then we go back into the wheat she star. Uh, have another quick look at that. Obviously we've got all the COVID secure and everything like this. And also, if you don't know, a book has been published about the story of the farm. So that was my, my story. <laughs> uh, there we are back out look at that view see over honestly if you were here in a sunny day and it's at our oh, views are absolutely stunning the final thing to look at is a farmhouse you could hire this again separate it's like a home from home experience you literally get the entire house in here is um a, like a hollywood style makeup areas got two of those lovely big space bluetooth speakers Got the television all to get ready for you with your guests and everything. Crazy wallpaper. Have it in here is where you get the entire kitchen. This is for you to enjoy. Again, espresso coffee machines. You've got the home from home. You can do your thing. You can fill the fridge with prosecco, whatever you want. That's all set up for you. We walk the way through. You've got a little hallway here, and then going up the stairs. Here we are. Nice plush carpet. It's all relatively new carpet. And then we've got the main bedroom, which has a beautiful four-poster bed. Very luxurious. In there. Then you have your main area. You have a lovely dressing table. It is quite a big room, so this camera isn't doing this justice at all. Out there, you can peek through the window on the morning of your wedding and maybe spot your other half waiting. Got your dressing table, you have a little bathroom in there for you. And so there we are. And through here, this can act as a dressing room or another double bedroom, double bed, you know, just as an extra room for bridesmaids or whatever. And then walking through here, you've got another bedroom, so three bedrooms in total, and that's your bridesmaids um, in there, ready in there we just don't want and all the rooms are well equipped they've got televisions they've got everything in here as well and that's another so that's a bathroom with a, another shower 
So, I think, I'll be honest, and I'm now 20 minutes exactly. So I did say it would take about 20 minutes. So there you go. Now I dare turn the camera around to talk to you because last time I did that, it stopped the whole thing just as I was nearly finished. So I'm sorry if, I'm, if you think this is a very impersonal video, but it's certainly not meant to be. But there you go. I've shown you all the features. It doesn't do it justice doing this virtual and we are so fed up that we can't, you can't actually come and visit here. But honestly, I do do hope that when you come, you take advantage of our Book With Confidence scheme because every single person last time who returned from the Book With Confidence booked when they came to the venue. Because the one feedback we get from everybody is that photographs and videos just don't do the place justice. So there you go. Hopefully that's all right for you. And we so, so look forward to seeing you. Take care and stay safe, everybody. Bye.